Hello everybody, it's uh, this is Dan from Geekazoid Tech. I want to show you a program, a, an app that actually uh, is really cool. If you're bored and you want to go ahead and watch some movies and whatnot, you can do whatever you want with this particular app. I mean, it's got the latest uh, movies. It tells you uh, when they were made, things like that. The only drawback to this, this program, or this app, I should say, is that it is, it's got ads, okay? What you want to do with the ads is just say no to them and, and then uh, pick what you want. Like, for example, if I pick on, uh, let's go here. First, I want to talk about the different features of this app. Uh, the top right-hand corner, you're going to see where it says home. There's going to be a green uh, line. It's, it's turned green underneath the, where it says home. Now, that's going, to be, that's going to come up when you first start the app. And that's going to come up to what you see here, which is a different, the different movies that you can see and so on and so forth. So, basically, uh, when you first launch the program, you'll probably get an ad. Uh, you just say no to the ad, and then uh, it'll come up to this uh, item here. Now, um, you have, also have where it says genres. Uh, of course, you get action, adventure. Different types of movies, uh, things like that. Like uh, I like uh, action movies and stuff like that. If you want to go to action movies, it'll show you exactly some of the action movies uh, that are on here. Um, if you go back to, I'm going to go down to war movies, for example. You'll see some of the more um, popular war movies, things like that. So you kind of get the idea. I'm going to scroll down here. I'm going to go tap on with the three lines, three uh, horizontal lines that are up on top on the top left. Uh, basically, you've got your favorites. You can favorite these things. Your watch list, you can put them to your watch list. Your new ad, things like that. You can you can play around with it. It's, it's fairly straightforward. Now, if you want to search for a particular movie, like, for example, uh, I'll search for Die Hard, for example. I'll search for Die Hard. And what I'll do is just hit my my search down here, and there's all your Die Hard movies. Okay, so pretty much it'll show you exactly what what you got going on. You got comedy movies, things like that. Um, so now when you tap on these uh, the movies and things like that, um, I'll go ahead and do. Oh, I don't know. Let's see here. I was watching uh, um, Die Hard with a Vengeance earlier. So I'll go down to see if I can find it. Die Hard with a Vengeance. Uh, as you can see, Raiders of the Lost Ark is here. The Incredibles, things like that. Pulp Fiction. Um, Wally. Okay. Here's Die Hard with a Vengeance. When you tap on Die Hard with a Vengeance, it's going to come up with something like this. You can actually put it to your watch list. Which the watch list is, is right here. On the very top okay don't worry about that unless you want to actually favorite these things or you want to put them to a watch list um, and so on and so forth now the green arrow pointing to the right is basically just a, uh, kind of like a trailer it plays the trailer for the movie now the it tells you the status it was released it was release date it shows you the original language runtime the budget the revenue that it made Genres and it gives you an overview of what the movie is about Now that green circle on the bottom right hand corner is actually the play button Okay, I'm going to show you the play button here. I'm going to tap it It says you can choose to play in 480p 720p or 360p uh, Some of these have 1080p so you might want to uh, Check it out. I usually play it in 720p. So I'll tap 720p It's going to load of course you see a you see a uh, um, an ad come up. You just tap the X on the top right hand corner, and it'll start playing. Now it takes a, takes a minute, about a couple seconds for it to start playing, um, and it's gonna buffer. And then what you'll do is you'll see uh, the movie come up. Now so I'm gonna show you something here when this movie comes up. Um, you'll see the player. It's coming up right now. There you go. Now you're going to see an ad on the top. Just tap it. It's going to go full screen. Okay. And then, of course, you got your player items here. Things like that. You just tap pause. And I'll, I'll tap back. It'll say press back again to exit. 
you press it twice, it'll go back to where you were. Now, I don't want to, like I said, I don't want to show any um, portions of the video because it'll violate the YouTube uh, um, terms of service, things like that. And um, you'll, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about there. But... Um, you guys will enjoy it as much as I do. Um, this, this is a, I pass the time when I'm not busy and doing anything. Um, you'll check it out. It's kind of cool. So, um, this again, the way you get to this, I'm not sure on iOS, if it's available on iOS or not, but on the, uh, Android app store, you just search for M tube. M tube is movie tube and you'll have the new the newest version of this because they update it every every month or every couple of weeks with new new movies and videos things like that so I hope you enjoy it again it's in the Android app store uh, if you go to the Play Store you'll be able to find it just type in M tube and uh, enjoy the enjoy the app guys again this is Dan with Geekazoid Tech I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Um, and thanks for watching. And please, uh, if you can, subscribe and hit that like button. Uh, it helps me out greatly. I would like to get at least a thousand subscribers if I can, or a thousand likes on this video. Um, I understand that uh, a lot of people are doing this because they want to make money, but I want to show you some of the stuff that I actually use and play around with. You know, as far as being a geek in tech and a techie, you know. So check it out. Play around with it, enjoy it, and uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, you guys have a wonderful weekend.